Hey, 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 what's up, guys? Yusuf Elias here from EXP Realty. Today, I'm very excited, very excited to go over this uh, very interesting program called KV Core with EXP Realty. Uh, KV Core comes with EXP Realty for free, but some friends have contacted KV Core and said it's about $500 to $1,000. So, I'm getting this for free. I'm really excited to go over this. Um, I love this software. I was just on the phone with one of my friends. I was telling him all about the cool things that this software does. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. We're on the dashboard right now, okay? You click here, you come to the dashboard, and um, let it load up a little bit. Refresh. We have 22 inbound calls for today. We haven't made any calls out. And we have no task because it's a Saturday, I guess. So the program has tasks in it automatically for you to follow up with clients. Um, it also has uh, text reminders like right here. You know, it reminds your your the people that that are on your uh, database. You know, to do something like, hey, are you still searching for a property? Right here, she's like, not looking anymore, thank you. And then we were, I already responded and said, no problem. Um, also, 19 hours ago, one of the people on the database viewed a home. And it will tell you which home they actually viewed. And then you can go on it and see the listing. So it's a home right here. It's on Greenfield with a, field, with a view and, um, no, I mean with the pool, sorry, and uh, some palm trees. So it's pretty cool. That could be used follow up with the client and ask them if they're interested to go see this home again if people look at homes you see it right here on the dashboard new lead everything right here is on the dashboard it's very interesting uh, because it just keeps everything in check here you already know what your you know database is looking at what kind of houses they're into so it just makes it easier for you to help them out the smart CRM this is the second tab on this software. This is the smart CRM right here. Okay, for for I, I I'm I'm gonna try to uh, cover these names, but but if I can't, um, I'm sorry about that. They're just names. Um, it's very interesting. Let's go on, click on my name, and if you see right here, this is the the dashboard of of a particular lead. Okay. So it, it will tell you the emails that have been sent to them, um, the upcoming touches. If you click on that, you'll see what's coming up, what the software will do next. Uh, property views. They view two properties, which is right here. That was a test lead under my name, as you, have, as you can see. Um, you can rate the people. You can rate the lead. You can text them. You can email them. You can call, and, or you can add a note. You know, test lead. So, more actions. We have sharing contact, transferring the lead to a team member. Uh, you can find the person on Facebook, Google, LinkedIn and these social media networks that are coming up right now. So let's get out of here. Um, there's another there's another tab right here that I like. It's, it's a quick actions. You can add a contact, you can call people, you can add a call, send an email, you can add a blog post to your website from here. And uh, I use this pretty often. So you can also add a contact right here. You come in here, you write the name, the email, phone number, and then you press yes. You choose if it's a seller or renter, um, and then you go on. You save it, and you add a contact. Listings. This is integrated with the MLS. So everything on the MLS is on here, okay? So when let's say you're looking for a house in Spring Valley. You come to Spring Valley, you search that, and then boom. Anything you search can be found by this uh, listings tab. Uh, you can search for zip codes, MLS numbers, all these good stuff. And then you can click on it and click, click on a random property. 
And then you get choices with this property. You can send it out as an email. You get a link, direct link uh, associated with your website. So if people want more information about this property, they're going to have to put in their email so they can get more information. More actions, you can send it via text message, add to save, email to hashtag, text to hashtag, search Twitter. You can generate a code. You can print a flyer for this property. You can boost property. You can post it to Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and Craigslist. And I have a pretty interesting video about Craigslist. Go look that up in the previous videos. Um, without further ado, uh, let me see. What did I forget? Um, right here, you can see the pictures, the map, similar properties. We'll show you similar properties to this one, rentals as well. I don't do not rentals, but this is just for the sake of example. Okay. Now we're going to go to the marketing autopilot. Marketing autopilot is very interesting. It has five different um, kind of like things you can do on the marketing autopilot. Right here, you can start a campaign. You know, you can create your own campaign of what you want to do, um, you know, when a, a lead comes in. You know, if it's a prospect, if it's a buyer, what do you, what do you, what kind of messages, what kind of emails do you want to send out to these people? Um, and then we have search alerts. Search alerts are like alerts that go out for your buyers that alerts them of certain properties that are coming on the market. These can come very, very uh, handy when people are like, yeah, send me some properties and I'm going to keep searching. Every time you send them properties, they're like, oh, this guy's thinking about us. This guy knows what we need. That's awesome. Behavior automation. Behavior automation is very interesting as well. I haven't used it as much as I should be, but here's what it's all about. Okay. It's already set up for you. So you don't need to do anything with it or uh, tweak it or you know, they've already set it up to where it should be, you know. So I try not to mess it up so much. Lead, if, if the lead revisits after 14 days, there's a certain email that gets sent out, you know, and a certain uh, email that gets sent out, which is this one right here. I'm glad you were spending a bit of time on my website again. Looks like you are doing a few different home searches. And then, boom, contact your lead, follows up with them through email and through text. So this is very cool. Lead visits the site five times in the last week. Another message will go out to them. And you can you can edit that. I don't, I don't think we can edit that. No. So we can't edit that. This is just set up um, for extra, you know, when people behave in a certain way, a different email will be sent out to them. And I think it's very, very interesting how they set this up. Um Another thing, we have the lead validation. Every time you get a lead, it's going to validate where it came from, their email, if it's legit, if it's good, if it's not. It's going to tell you their Facebook. It's going to tell you their LinkedIn. It's very cool. It just gives you more information about the lead. And then we have the KV Mobile Dialer. So this is an app. You download an app, and you have all the leads right here from your smart CRM, and you can click on the dialer and start dialing one by one. It's very handy when you're uh, follow on, follow, following up with your day-to-day -day clients. And then we have the lead engine. I feel like I can go forever with this software. Um, we have the landing pages. We have squeeze pages. Um, we have the lead drop box. We have the call capture. And then we have the bulk import CMA builder. And they recently added these two, the millions mapped and the open house app. Um, I would want to go through every single one of these certain, um, let's just say, services that the software offers because, to be honest, if you're trying to create landing pages, you're gonna, sometimes most agents use a whole separate software just to do a landing page, and then they would connect it to the IDX, and then they would connect it to somewhere else. Here with KV Core, everything is in one place. Okay, so you don't need to be bouncing around softwares and apps. You have everything you need in here. You have the CMA builder. You have the call capture. This is very interesting. You know how some people are like, text this number to this number and you'll get a different, certain message? This is what this is. If you test, text the code 91977 to 
682497, you will get this message. Okay. So that's what it's all about right here. If you guys are interested in going through the, the squeeze pages, I would be more than happy to go into more details into the squeeze pages, show you how they look like. There's seller squeeze pages, there is a buyer squeeze pages, and um, we will we'll probably go over these in a different video. But this is just an overview of this the KV Core program. Now we're going to transactions. Um, I haven't done any transactions on the KV Core, um, so you're not you're you're not going to see anything. But once you add transactions to your KV Core, this is where it's going to be. Okay, we have the website and the IDX is all over here. Okay, so if you want to view website, just click right here, and this is my website. Okay, this is the website I get with KV Core. People can search MLS number, address, zip code, whatever, bedroom, you know, and then there's listings right here: houses, multifamily, condos, and land. I made this a little bit bigger because um, I'm working with a lot of land buyers. So we have the agent, agent profile, listings, we're hiring, you know, come work at eXp Realty. This is where people, if people want to join my team, I have my LinkedIn, my YouTube channel, my Google Plus right here. And then let's go back to the KV Core. So you can edit your website from here the site content you can edit from here the the template of the website how the website content is basically how many cities are you servicing and in what and 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 what pages are they going to have so back then we used to we used to create pages for certain cities manually and for me to create 398 pages it, it would probably take me months right uh, or, or a whole year just to create these kind of pages every day. And it's going to be so much time consuming. With um, KV Core, all you got to do is you can add the city and it will automatically create that page. So here's what we're going to do. We're just going to, we're going to, so this is what the cities we have right now. We can add more. We can add well, if it loads up, my Wi-Fi is a little bit, um, it's good. So we're going to add this zip code. We're going to use Realtor and Spring Valley. And the text will be Yusuf Elias Realtor and... Spring Valley. So if people are searching for these keyword keywords, my website is gonna pop up. Okay, and that's the whole point of creating service areas and and CEO. This is huge. I mean, we charge people a lot, a lot of money when when we did marketing. We charge a lot of people a lot of money for creating separate pages for separate zip codes or separate cities. You know, so it's very important. We have the blog right here. I think I have one blog on this website. We have the blog, which is important for SEO as well, search engine optimization. If people are searching for that, you know, how to buy a home in San Diego and you have an article about how to buy a home in San Diego and that pops up, that's your client. You know, that's that's a, that's a way of getting people and getting leads. You can embed stuff to your website, you know, from third-party softwares and stuff like that. Like a code, you can embed a property search onto your website, onto your other website or something else. This is what I have on usefulize.com. I have a property search and I have a seller evaluation, which is this right here that people get. Wedges, they have wedges as well. So 
So you can add a wedge by coming here to remove a wedge from your route. Please use the set side editor. So you're gonna have to use the side editor for the wedges. I haven't really played with this with the wedges. I'm happy with the website I have. It looks awesome. It looks amazing from a marketer po point of view. So I don't need to be doing any extra stuff. Keep it simple. Keep the software how it's how it's been created. I try to like. I don't want to invent the wheel. Reinvent the wheel. I just want to go along with what they the software creators think is the best because dude if you're able to build a software like this that does it all you probably know it all so i trust the people that created this i trust exp realty for trusting kv core and um i mean the exp realty agents have been doing a lot of good stuff using this this kv core so the last step we have here is the marketplace the marketplace is basically a place where you can go and buy ads you can buy Google ads, you can buy listing ads, you can buy buyer ads, Facebook ads, and you just come here and you buy some ads. Now for me, I don't need to buy these because I'm a marketer, I can buy my own ads. But what I would be interested in is maybe testimonial tree, get five star reviews, lead gen and nurture. I could be interested in this right here to see what it's all about, okay? Another thing eXp offers is the e Skyslope. Skyslope is used for transactions, used to track your transactions, how many transactions you made, docu signs, and all that things. So, and then this is the same thing, basically dot loop is just like sky Skyslope. And there, I like this: people work, not paperwork. So it's very true. They believe in you know uh, online kind of like transactions and docu signs and all that stuff. So that's pretty cool. And then at the end of the software, we had the last step is the business analytics. This is where you come in and you see how your business is doing. How many sales have you been doing? How many leads have you been generating? How many stuff is going on? What's going on? Where your leads are coming from? Bing, direct, email, whatever. So this is where you come in. You're going to see how many people have been searching your site. You know, July 2, July 27, Dropbox 7. We got seven leads, 12 direct, and then as the time goes on, we're getting more people, you know, to um, come into the website. And then we're getting a lot of people from Bing, Direct, Dropbox, and that's only because they have, we have about 400 pages created with the, with the city names. So that's what brings visitors to the website. You know, all these visitors are from... SEO okay transaction uh, do we have opportunities 124 opportunities contract 30 I think these numbers are just like hypothetical um, because I haven't really I've been fairly new to this um, software but um, I think throughout the time is gonna change um, but yeah this is basically it this is the business analytics this is KV Core. I hope you enjoyed this overview tutorial. I tried not to make it long, but I mean, there's a lot of stuff to talk about in this um, software, and there's a lot more for me to cover. So if you have any questions, if you have any concerns, if you want to know how you can get the software, if you want to know how to sign up with eXp Realty, how do you switch to eXp Realty and have access to the software for free, let me know, and we can have a talk, and we can you know, get you set up and all that stuff. I've been using this for a month. I can't tell you how excited I am to use it. And I can't wait for you to use this software and utilize it and make a lot of sales. All right, until next time, see you guys on the next tutorial.